Let's go exploring with Daniel Cook right here on the Veritable Quandary. Here we are! This is Daniel Cook go karting! Hi, I'm here at Jim, and today he's going to teach me how to go kart. Hi, Jim. This is Daniel Cook on a bike, in a plane, on a farm, playing games with many places and friendly faces. We'll have lots of fun with Daniel Cook. What's the best part about racing cars? Well, the best part about racing go-karts is you get to meet new friends. Mm -hmm. uh, it's fun going around with a whole bunch of other people and you get to battle back and forth on the track. I just like, I like, I like going so fast. Yeah, it's going fast is fun. My brother has a, an electrical cart. Yeah, they're fun. Yeah, my uncle got it for him for uh, Christmas. Are you going to race big cars when you grow up? Um, I'm planning on it. I don't know if I will, but if I'm good enough, I think I will. So that's going to be good. If you do and you ever get on TV, I'll probably watch it. Yeah. Because I watch the races sometimes. Yeah. What's the hardest part about racing? Well, the hardest part is going around the track for long periods of time. And like you get crashing? really tired. Yeah, without crashing. And and another hard part is if you do crash in a, into a big crash and you have to fix a lot of stuff in a short period of time. What's the worst crash you've been in? The worst crash I've been in is... I flipped. Wow. Yep. Did you get any scars from your big flip crash? Uh, no, not a lot of scars, but when I flipped, a whole bunch of sand got in my helmet and it went all into my mouth. Yucky. Up my I've nose. eaten sand before. I've, I've eaten grass before by accident. Oh. My dad ate a bug by accident. Oh. He ate a fly. He was like, wait a minute. I think it was a bee, actually. I don't know. It was just like, yeah. Can I try sitting in it? Yeah, you can. Sure. The seat must be awkward. No, it's not that bad. You get used to it. Feels funny. It sort of feels funny. Whoa. I think it's a bit big for you. Nah, not really. Does it have a horn? No, it doesn't actually. I don't. I wish they did because I think that would be fun. But... Yeah. Where's the gas pedal? The gas pedal is this pedal way down there. Great. Right. Then... That one. No, that one over there. This one over here is a brake pedal. This one make me go? Yeah. This one make me stop? Yes. My legs just aren't quite that long enough. Well, if I sit back, they're not. But if I sit forward like that... Almost there, aren't they? Yeah, almost. Ooh, you like that one. Why do you have to wear a helmet? You have to wear a helmet so that you don't hit your head if you ever fall out. Do you have to wear anything else when you release? Yeah, you have to wear a suit, and you have to wear something called a rib vest, which is kind of like a vest that you can put under your suit or over your suit, and you have to wear a neck brace. What about when you're just go-karting? Yeah, when you're go-karting, you just have to wear a helmet. That's too bad. I wish I had a racing suit. Actually, Daniel, I uh, brought one for you. Do you want to uh, go put it on and go out and drive around the track? Okay. All right. important to wear when you get into a car? A seat belt? Yep. All right, so on this side, there's the brake, and this side, there's the gas. Hey, I have a cool idea. Let's go ask my dad if, if he wants to race us. Do you think we could beat him? Yeah. Hey, Dad, come on over. We want to race ya. All right, Dad, here's the racing challenge. Three laps. Winning team gets ice cream. Losing team doesn't get anything. Maybe I'll let you look at my ice cream. Ah, oh, come on. Look at it. I'm going to eat it. Ah. This is Daniel Cook racing his dad.
good. Do you think I could be a racer? You know what? You had the speed going really fast. You turned really well. You didn't mess up at all. Once you turn eight, you're going to be a great racer. Yay! Thank you so much, Tim, for teaching me how to go kart. That was so cool. <laughs> This episode is over, but the very best of my collection is banned on YouTube. To see what you have been missing, go to archive.org and search for Gyro Screw Loose, and I'll see you there.